Hey everyone and welcome back to another Bisect Hosting server tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to go over how to change versions on a 7 days to die server. First, we're going to log into our Bisect Hosting games panel and choose our 7 days to die server. Next, we're going to choose the stop button to stop the server. We will then go to the startup tab. And on the other versions table, we are going to input the desired version. If you need a list of versions, I will have a link in the description with all of the versions you can change this to. Once you've added a new version, we will then go to the auto update field and we need to change this to one. Once that's finished, we can go back to the home tab, start our server, and we'll have changed the version on our seven days to die server. We will now go over how to change versions on your seven days to die client. First from the steam library, we're going to right click seven days to die and choose properties. We are then going to select betas. And from here, the drop down menu, you can select any version that you would like. Once you've selected the version, it'll automatically start to install that version. If you have any questions, check out our knowledge base, bisecthosting.com slash KB, or you can submit a support ticket on our website. If this guide was helpful, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe for more content like this, comment down below which guide you would like to see next, and we'll see you around.